It's a story about a group of frogs traveling in the woods. Two of them fall down into a deep pit and begin jumping, trying to get out of the pit. When the other frogs, the, all the other frogs gather around the pit, and when they see how deep the pit is, they begin to tell those two frogs that they are as good as dead. They tell them the pit is too deep. They tell them they are hopeless. They tell them they should just lie down and die. One of the two frogs in the pit takes heed to what the other frogs are saying. He listens to all that negativity. And you know, where focus goes, energy flows, right? If we focus on negativity, it, it grows in our mind, right? And so that, 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 that one frog, he listens to all that negativity. He gets discouraged and depressed and he just... He gives up. He stops jumping, lies down, and dies. But the other frog, the other frog keeps on jumping and jumping and jumping. The crowd of frogs outside of the pit continue to yell at him words of discouragement. You're hopeless. This pit is too deep. Just lie down and die. You'll never be able to make it out of this pit. But that frog he keeps on jumping and jumping and jumping, and finally he makes it out of the pit. Everybody was surprised. And then they discovered that that frog was hearing impaired. He, he wasn't able to hear all of those negative comments. In fact, when he was in the pit, although he could not hear what they were saying, he could see all the body movement, and he misinterpreted their body language. He thought that they were trying to encourage him the entire time. Can you imagine that? The, the, the frog was jumping up, and the crowd was yelling at him, You're hopeless. This, just give up. There's no way you're going to make it out of this pit. Just give up. And he's like, okay, guys, I'm coming. I'm coming. <laughs> it's a cute story. But please don't miss the moral of the story. The moral of the story is this. Those two frogs were in the same exact negative situation. But one of them had a negative attitude and the other one had a positive attitude. And the difference in their outcomes was determined by the difference in their perspectives, their attitudes. And so as we go through life, let's, let's be mindful of the thoughts that come into our minds. And let's make sure that we focus on positive thoughts. Because where focus goes, energy flows.